Hello everyone, how are you? I'm here to present you my latest project. This is a junk journal and it's made for Tsunami Rose Design. She has an Etsy store and a blog and a Facebook group and Facebook page and all that stuff. And I will put the links below so you can go and see. She has beautiful designs. Uh, she designs papers and ephemera for your junk journal, your journal, your layouts, your uh, albums. You can even use it, the subbicyclades, you can use the... She has a variety of uh, pictures, in the pictures you can use as a vocal point for your project. So, without further ado, let's start with this journal. Uh, this is uh, a 9 by 7 sorry I apologize for that this is a 7 and something 7 and a half by 9 and a quarter uh, journal and the spine is um, uh, all 2 and a half inches and uh, this is the spine. I can zoom out. Something happened to my logic anyway. And this is the back cover. It's a hard chipboard. It's made from scratch. The paint looks like uh, it's copper. It looks like rust and stuff. So I have two eyelets for closer. Let's start. This is the front cover with ephemera from Tsunami's Rose Design Paper, Design Line. She, said she has too many uh, great papers and great designs, huge variety, you can download instantly and her prices are crazy low, crazy crazy low. I think she has everything two and a half uh, uh, dollars. Can you see that? So pop over the air, go look her page, her store, you will find great things to that you can love and create with. She has amazing stuff, she creates many many things. This is a, a Greek account book. It's a real one, it, even it's punch and an old one. It's not of use anymore. So you can see. More ephemera. And I made a pocket over here with lace. You see? And it's glued on there. It's a very functional pocket. And uh, this is a fuzzy cut ephemera in chipboard from her store. And some. You can use them to journal. This journal place. A piece of uh, leftover lace. Scrap. I have. Uh, this is a cooking paper. I have. Uh, burn the edges in the design paper and I didn't cover the design paper so I won't cover the beauty it's very beautiful and this is a line so you can write on it so I wouldn't want to cover it so I cover the empty spaces this is a ticket and and in a journey place ephemera a scrap of lace my dog, sorry for the noise. So, another pocket. Place to write. The theme in this album is mostly, I try to keep it flowers and seeds. So, this is another page, Burn Ages. This, uh, I I coffee dye it after I print it, that's a mistake. First you coffee dye the paper, then you print. I coffee dye it, so I smashed it, but I thought it would be rustic, so I put it there. 
and this is a seed bag and I bought it from book page, Greek book pages and uh, this is a piece of lace and this is a paper bucket and another ephemera from Tsunami's Rose store these are uh, actually the you saw them before and I just fuzz cut them the pages are, have uh, stitching all around I don't know if you can see they have stitching in some place, uh, pages I put lace here's another ephemera with journal place this has a book page in the back cooking paper with the paper page clip so you can use it to mark your pages it's another beautiful design really it's my mother's favorite I like it too journal places that you can use beautiful vintage looking paper I left this paper blank because I did something with the coffee I made this uh, jolly stamp you can say this has stitch lace this beautiful design paper for Tsunamis Tsunami Rose she has great great prizes and huge variety of things to pick I'm telling you, you can use it almost everywhere from your layouts this is a something my friend Patricia from Holland gave me and I copied it and I left it like that this is the center of the first signature and it has almost three signatures but uh, I left it like that I put some pearls at the edges if you don't like it you can cut this and glue the edges and use it as an envelope that's why I didn't decorate it a scrap piece of lace another card dark card and journal place some tickets another journal page all the ephemera from her store this beautiful page this is lace you can see it I fuzzy cut lace and this is a pocket with an ephemera inside Here, I don't know if you can see, are some laces over here and an ephemera and a paper dolly and a small piece of paper. This is a pocket with some brads and journal places. Another ephemera from her store. It was really, really fun working with this. It was my first time working with design paper and I really, really love it. But I made the album quite chunky. Uh, this is a beautiful paper from her store. Postcard. Journey Place. And another firmer from her store. Ephemeras. I printed these two why too big and now that's why it doesn't look very nice uh, I don't know I haven't managed to get the shapes yet uh, music page so these are also from her store I'm telling you ladies go over there she has time products she designs it all by herself paper clip, clip and paper and she has huge variety these are two pockets one is here and one is behind and this is just an ordinary journal page ahead from a notebook page I mean as I was telling you she has huge variety and crazy low prices and uh, this is Berla Pen Ephemera from her store. Crazy, crazy low prices. She's a very sweet person. You should follow her blog. You should go see her page. 
uh, she makes journal also. I really like her, she's a very cool person. Very sweet. This is a flower, sappy flower, sort of. I couldn't make it. It's all related to bulky. And uh, another tag, no tag, a journal place. Sorry, I'm going too fast, but I have real issues with the camera. This is another design paper. This is because I thought the gap between was too wide. I put this small place just for journaling here, just to make it notes. I put this bird cage. This bird cage was from a DT pack in the past I had from Natasha Scarbo Corner. This uh, small bird cage. I have some love left over. This beautiful paper, I love the roses and the stuff I have from Tsunami's Rose Designs. I didn't put anything inside, just a piece of scrap doily. Because uh, I forgot also to put the envelopes, I had prepared the envelopes to put inside. Uh, I forgot it while I was doing the binding, the signatures. Um, that's why I put some here and I have this journal plates. And it's from Design Paper. I, I forgot to put many stuff, and although I forgot to put many stuff, it became way too bulky. This is for a beautiful, beautiful designs that she has, so I make a notebook, a small notebook from those. This is also a, this, uh, Signatures Binding, and I just put some The Great Place uh, pearls there. A paper clip I just made. Another envelope. No, I don't think I have something there. Some Greek book pages. I like how it bleeds. This and that. So I really love this page. I really love it. I have burned the ages. This is a big pocket from an ephemera and has an envelope inside with a paper. Another page here. I love this one because it's open the air. I just fuzzy cut it, it has a gap. So I made a pocket here. We see some laces stitching all around. This is burn ages. I more general place. It's full of pockets and space to use to write or put your photos or whatever you do with them. I don't really know how to use them. I will probably use them to write as a journal. It's my first time working with designs and I really, really love it. it you, you can make more beautiful things with design papers. It's another journal plate with lines and paper and to, to write on. This is an applique flower. This pearl, I made it with hot glue and uh, nail polish. If you can see it over there, it's a, like a flat bar pearl. You, I can make it a tutorial and show you how you done. it's done. Uh, you can use it with hot glue and make pearls and dots for your projects. Oh, come on. I put a scrap of paper doily. This is a small booklet for with uh, handwriting. Just place over there. Another, and this open up like that. Open. Here's some other fingers. Vintage advertise a lot. I love vintage advertise, vintage uh, um, magazine papers. This is the seeds also. Another pocket. This uh, journal will go for sale. So if anyone, I will sell this. If anyone will be interested, um, uh, I'm selling it. I'm going to sell it. Uh, I'm going to sell it uh, in UK. It cost uh, thirty-five, uh, 
30 euros to ship and uh, in the rest of the world it cost um, uh, 36 so I'm going to sell it uh, in UK uh, 65 euros and in the rest of the world 70 oh, sorry in the UK 60 euros and in the rest of the world uh, 65 it's not a great a uh, very crazy price considering the posting codes it's another page with a I guess make a book clip <laughs> another flower I mean shabby flower and here is an envelope for her store she has beautiful envelopes this one is uh, not the best example she has beautiful stunning envelopes with great uh, with great designs and uh, beautiful shapes with uh, various shapes of uh, the envelope it's very beautiful I haven't printed one yet this is another page so as I was telling you I will sell this one uh, it will be 65 for the rest of the world and 64 UK I don't know why they have this difference in some countries of Europe the post office here is uh, 30 euros per kilo and this is quite heavy it became quite heavy music notes and uh, in the rest of the world even if it's Australia China it doesn't matter it's uh, 36 euros per kilo so I'm selling this 60 for Europe and 65 for the rest of the world. Can you see? Uh, doily, paper doily. This will be our ephemeras. This has a, a beautiful design paper. This has uh, 36 uh, seats, it's signature, this I consider as one page, front and back it's one page, so it has 36 and 36 for the two signature, it's uh, 72 pages and with the middle one it's go around 80 pages, 18, 18, I didn't sorry that, sorry I apologize, journal please. This has this beautiful lace over here, and journal places, place for you to write whatever you wish. This is an envelope from a book page, and another journal place over there. Another pocket with two ephemera. Beautiful pages. I like that farm side, uh, botanical side. That's why I use burlaps and stuff. Uh, I don't know if this, you can see it's a uh, dainty lace. Can you see this? It's a dental lace with two. That's why, because it's very dental delicate, I didn't put big femurs there. I just put this two. Another page. This is hype stock. And Another page. Lined paper, I like this page. You can see I just minimize it, it, they, it comes bigger, and I minimize it because I really like it. I use it a couple of times, and I like how the edges was like burn when you printed it. I made it with one ephemera, I burned the edges and cut Dana angle and made the pocket. Many many places to write on, and you will have some great writing on. <laughs> so you probably would like that. I don't know. This is another ephemera. Many pockets, many stuff to use. Beautiful 
design paper. Okay. These are tea kits and I cut, printed them in, in, in two sides. You can see them, they are blurred because I coffee dyed it after I printed. I'm told you that the mistakes of the beginner. So this is another framer. And it's open up like that so you can write inside. I like this page, I really like, I like this page because it has these beautiful uh, roses. It has this book page as a pocket and it has a piece of, you can see the lace over there. So, and it has these beautiful ephemeras. And we're done now. Just two beautiful ephemeras. And another page, design paper. And in the front and the back I have these decorative pages used and it's decoupage on and it has this lace that's very uh, big and a sturdy pocket if you can see. You can use bigger stuff there and I put those ephemeras. So that's my first duck journal as a DT timber as a DT, DT member for Tsunami Rose Designs. I'm telling you, she has a beautiful, beautiful images you can go and pick and kits and stuff for journaling and whatever you wish. Beautiful stuff for all the ladies. You can use it in various, various projects. You will find them... You, I'm sure you will find many stuff over there you will go crazy for. She has very, very low, not just reasonable prices. I mean, Come on, she has crazy, crazy um, low prices. Each pack costs uh, two and a half uh, dollars, and it has uh, you get a sum of amount. You don't get uh, just a piece. And uh, she's a very sweet lady. Thank you, Daisy, for picking me to be your duty member. I really, really love to be uh, play with these beautiful papers. And uh, if anybody is interested for this journal, I told you again the price will be 60 for euros and 65 for the rest of the world. I don't think the price is crazy considering we have crazy, crazy high postage here. It changed in the beginning of the year. We had very, very low post cost in the back, uh, back then. And uh, from the 2000, 16 the post uh, in some places triple so now we have uh, 30 and 36 mm, that's my cut post I won't bother you with that anyway this will be zipped in everywhere uh, in every where you want and it's looking for a nice home and I made it with love so I hope you like it and I punch a hole and put an eyelet there so maybe you will uh, hang something like a charm, whatever you wish. I'm uh, sorry, I didn't have something to make a chunky charm over there. So, thank you for watching. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you like it. Thank you, thank you, Daisy, for uh, having me or your team. I really, really love your papers. They are stunning. I really love playing with them. Hugs and kisses. We will speak the soon. And don't forget to go to the Tsunami Rose Design and have a look. I'm thinking you. I'm sure you will love it. Hugs and kisses. We'll speak later. And don't forget, comment, share, share. Comment, share, like, subscribe. I find it. Okay. Bye bye. Sorry for the rumbling. <laughs>